What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Swag Buzz here back with another video. All right, so we're going to talk a little bit about the Bethune Cookman versus Jackson State game. Jackson State plays Bethune Cookman, the 0 and 7 Bethune Cookman. They're 0 and 7 overall. But first, if you like swag videos, you like this kind of content, subscribe and like the channel. I do swag videos all the time, so make sure you subscribe and like the channel and hit the notification bell so you'll know when the next video drops. But anyway, let's get into the video. So Bethune Cookman is 0-7 right now, and they're 0-4 in the swag. So they've lost four games in the swag. But Jackson Station still not look over these guys. These guys, their record doesn't show how talented they are. They're not a bad team. They just can't win right now. So they're just having a rough season, but they do have some talented players. And they might play you hard, so you can't look past them because, you know, you might slip up and lose if you look past these guys. So you can't underestimate your opponent. Jackson State has to come out and face them like they will be facing Prairie View. They need to come out guns a blazing, trying to really put their foot on these guys' neck and really win this game. Now, Deion Sanders would not be coaching this game, so that could be a factor. You know, who knows? Like, we'll see exactly what Jackson State team is made of. Will they carry on Dion's identity and energy while they are on the field, even though he's not there? We will see what happens with that. That could be a factor in the game. Now, Coach Gary Harrell will be taking over for Coach Prime while he's sitting down. And I'm pretty sure, he, you know, he knows the team and it will be comfortable for the guys to, you know, be taking orders from him because they do it all day in practice. So... I'm pretty sure this would not be a big change for them. I'm pretty sure they're gonna miss seeing Coach Prime on the sidelines. But honestly, I think Jack State will be fine. They'll keep things rolling just like they always do. And they will probably come out and have a good game. I'm expecting them to blow Bethune Cookman out, but you just never know with these games in the swag. You know, some days you'll think a game was gonna be a blowout and it just come, becomes a competitive game. Like Alabama State, I thought Alabama State was gonna be a blowout, but their first half was competitive. <laughs> they went in tied, so you just can't look past any team in the SWAC. The SWAC is very unpredictable, but I'm guessing that Jackson State will blow these guys out, but who knows? I'm looking for Shador to really do some damage tomorrow. I'm really looking for him to throw for at least four touchdowns tomorrow to really up his stock. I mean, he's already one of the top quarterbacks in the SWAC. I mean, shoot, out of him and pass, him and pass are like the top quarterbacks in the SWAC right now. And even Shadur Sanders is getting national attention. I mean, the guy had a top 10 play on ESPN. So he's getting national attention, national notoriety. Like everyone knows who Shadur is. He's gonna be one of the main reasons that HBCU football becomes very prominent in in the sport, you know, as far as getting national TV coverage and things like that. So I think this is a beautiful thing. This is just year one, y'all. This is just year one. We're in year one. He's just a freshman. So you can only imagine his sophomore and junior season, how it would be, you know. So things are just going to get bigger and bigger from here. But as far as the game, yeah, I think this is going to be a blowout. You know, uh, I think Bethune Cookman would try to make a game of it in the first quarter. And then um, Jackson State would probably pull it out in the second quarter and just really just start to pour on the points. That's my prediction. <laughs> y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Uh, but as far as the other games this weekend, I think this probably is going to be the most watched game in the SWAC this weekend. All the games this weekend are going to be pretty predictable. I mean, you have Prairie View playing Southern. You have Alcorn playing Texas Southern. You have FAMU playing Valley. Uh, and you have Arkansas going against <laughs> UAPB. So, I mean, these we might have a bunch of blowouts this weekend. So, yeah, expect this weekend to be kind of boring in the swag. Uh, not really that competitive because, like I said, all the games this weekend, uh, they're pretty lopsided. So, but we'll see, you know, some people might make a game out of these games. So, we'll see what happens. But well, yeah, anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Like and subscribe to the channel. I do swag videos all the time. So, like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you'll know when the next video drops. And I'll see you guys on the next video. All right.